Well, hello everyone, and welcome back to another video. My name is Anorak, you can call me Zed, and, um, I don't think we're gonna get another spruce sapling. Either way, we, uh, made some progress last episode. We got diamond armor, we opened our nether portal, etc, etc. Today, I had done some mining off camera, although I had not got any diamonds, so I'm gonna have to do some more of that in between episodes. But I did decide we are going to go to the Nether Fortress and kill some blazes. At least I'm pretty sure there's another fortress in this version. I have no idea. Either way, we're just going to explore in here. Oh, I need to write down coordinates real quick. But, uh, yeah. I'll probably show you guys if there's anything interesting, but since it's the old Nether generation, there probably isn't. Whoa, whoa. This zombie, this zombie piglin was just attacking me, so, um... That's not good. Oh, I almost forgot what I was here to do. Yes. Let me write down coordinates real quick, and yeah. 40, negative 4. Yep, they're attacking. Oh god. Okay, I'm going to die here, aren't I? Because I have zero food on me. Um, let me just... Do this. And, uh... Yeah, that was painful. <laughs> um, hmm. Ah, oh, dang it, it gave me hunger. Oh well. Well, once this wears off, we can get out of the hole, maybe. <sighs> this is just a pain. Okay. Uh, we just escaped from the nether. We are at half a heart, and we literally gained one gold nugget. The nether is a lot less forgiving in these versions, so, uh, I halfway don't want to even attempt anything yet, so that's not nice. But let's just hope we start healing soon. Alright, so, I am now fully healed, and I made a compass. This is because I was planning on making a map, but it turns out we have zero, uh, sugarcane. In fact, I'm not even 100% sure it's out in the version we're in. Also, I know boats are going to be absolutely terrible, so uh, that's going to be fun. But I also realized, wait, compasses in this version point to world spawn. Uh, okay, I was wondering why the boat was being slow. Huh, well... Okay, you can turn in this one just by looking a certain way, so that's something I actually kind of like, but I also know these boats are incredibly fragile, so... Hmm. Yeah. Huh. Let's look around for stuff. I don't know why that pig is in a tree. Well, I know that since the compass points towards world spawn, if we get lost, we can always follow it, and world spawn's pretty close to our house, so that's nice. Um, you uh, to get out, you have to break it. What? Excuse me? D if I, was, I was pressing the shift button to get out of it, and 
it was just not working. Do you have to destroy it? That That's weird. I don't like that. Oh well. Oh, did you guys just see that? The achievements were added in. We got an achievement for uh, making a crafting table, which we've already made before. <laughs> well, I'm going to keep exploring, because I still need to find more sugar cane. Boat, come back here. Why did the boat just, like, launch itself? Oh, okay, no. I've heard tales of lily pads destroying boats, and I have no idea how true it is, but I'm going to take my chances and just avoid them. Yep. They one hit your boat. Fun. Well, we got sugar cane, so we could go back. Or, okay, no, they, they still hadn't been, never, never mind, because I know at one version they were called reeds, and I was wondering if they were still called reeds in 1.1, apparently not. Either way, we are going to, I guess, collect a little bit more, and then head back. Well, it's turning night time. Uh, luckily, we're on ice, so we can move faster. But, uh, we may not be able to reach home without death. Hopefully we will, though. Ooh, that is some nice generation right there. That would have been a nice place to build our house. Hmm. Oh well. Although, I have the sneaking suspicion we're actually close to our house. Because this feels vaguely familiar. Hmm. I don't know. But I think... The current house we have is just going to be essentially the starter house. And then as we get to, like, you know, probably 1.12 and later, we're going to build an actual big, like, mega base almost. Sort of like they do in Hermitcraft. Although, ours is going to be overall much smaller scale, as we have less episodes to do it. And I am not a really great builder. But it will mean the episodes take longer to record. So, there is that drawback. Anyway, enough rambling. Let's keep moving. Because, yeah, there we are. I knew we were close. Alright, we just got to get across here. Yep, I know, take damage. We're going to quickly go to sleep, probably eat stuff, and I don't know what to do next. Alright, so we have now eaten and put our stuff up. Compass is still pointing towards spawn. I know the moment we go into the nether, pig pigmen are going to overrun us. I keep wanting to say piglins. Huh. Well, let's see. Hmm. Is there anything we can actually do? Oh, yeah, I almost forgot why we did the whole thing in the first place. I want to plant some sugarcane, and then with the growing sugarcane, we can make a map. 
So I just want to see. Okay, you get three. That's six. Okay, we can go ahead and do this and have some leftover uh, sugar cane, so that's nice. Let's see. Yes, we now have a map. It's map underscore zero. Let's see. Ah, uh, you can't see our house because it's under that. Uh, we could probably build something really quick to show this is our house. Uh, hmm, let's see. We don't have anything white up there, so guess I'm gonna do that. Hmm. Let's see. Let's hope it actually works out well. So our house is essentially right under this, so I'm just going to do this. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, meaning this is there, one, two, three, oh. one, two, three, let's go ahead and grab the map. See if we can see it once we've moved away. Oh wow. Um, hmm. It does not show it. Like, at all. Um, that's weird. Let's see. Let's add one more in each direction, maybe? Hmm. Wait. Oh, I had a terrible thought. Do maps in this version only update if you make a whole new map? Because if so, that's, that's going to be terrible. I just want to extend these two out a little bit more. Done. Because, uh, if so, we might have to completely make a new map. Now, uh, let's see. I'm going to try and survive this by jumping in the hole that our water is in. Oh, I actually did it. Nice. Hmm. Well, guess I'm going to have to get more water. <sighs> this is just a little bit annoying. There we go. Now we have some growing. I'm still really upset about the map thing not working out, but, uh, oh well. Win some, you lose some. Uh, I feel like we haven't done enough to constitute a full episode, because, let's see, we went to the nether, got beat up by a whole bunch of pigmen, I traveled mostly off-camera, and that was about it. Hmm. I feel like I never have enough stuff in each video. I don't know. Well, I can go ahead and start up a wheat farm as well, by hoeing the ground around the sugarcane. So, let's see, where did I put it? Mm, in here? Yes, in here. Good, good, good. Let's see, sugarcane can be planted there, so... Just gonna do this for now. There we go. Now we have melons, pumpkins, sugarcane, and wheat. And I think that's going to have to be it, because I don't know what else I can do. Other than try my hand at redstone, but uh, that would not end up so well. So I think that's going to have to be it for now. Uh, I always enjoy recording these videos, and I hope you guys enjoy watching them. As uh, the first video actually got quite a lot of views compared to most of my videos. But since then, the views have been dropping, so, you know, if you want to support me, it's always nice to watch another video. You could also remember to like, comment, and subscribe, as 
as I mentioned almost every video, that really does help me out a lot. And, yeah. Well, I have nothing else to say. So for now, goodbye!